It's... It's almost over. Occupying the skies of Tarinen in great abundance, the pop scale dragon is a timid creature, relying on small defenseless prey to satiate its hunger. The range of prey includes fish, small creatures, and eggs. When threatened, the pop scale dragon lives up to its name by flushing its body with heat. This heat triggers the explosive chemicals in the dragon's dried skin, causing it to combust in a dazzling display of sparks. This is used to frighten lesser aggressors, but against more persistent foes, the pop scale dragon shows its true colors and flies away to safety at top speed. Out. If you ignite him, he's a rope ahead of full prophecy To be the greatest beast the world has ever seen I feed him every day like the bones clean I feed him all the hate and he grows me And he gets caught through a big piss off quick And if you cross him, you might drop dead Metaphorically, of course, said to live this war Never getting bored, loves the blood and gore Always wanting more, feeding from the source They don't really understand until they feel the force apart And if you start shit, you'll be heartless in the darkness Torn apart quick, you left scars ripped You'll be chewed up and discarded and this world ain't right, won't accept it Negative energy, I expect it Once it's in your mind, it's infectious So fight for your life and reject it You better give me space, I'm protected My adrenaline spikes when I'm threatened And if you stay in my way, I'm aggressive Cause when there's no legs, it'll kill when I'm desperate Curled up in a leaf-shaped bundle among the trees of Taranem's mountainous areas, the pygmy leaf back lindworm is a small, timid omnivore that can fit comfortably in the palm of a human's hand. But doing so will open the hominid up to a painful sting. While the fairy light wyvern sting injects a venom that causes irritation, the pygmy leaf back lindworm's venom causes not only irritation, but near sightlessness and vertigo like effects. A cute sight to see munching on a berry in the wild, but do not let the compulsion to hold this dragonoid get the better of you. If you ignite him, he's a rope ahead of full prophecy To be the greatest beast the world has ever seen I feed him every day like the bones clean I feed him all the hate and he grows me And he gets caught through a big piss off quick And if you cross him, you might drop dead Metaphorically, of course, said to live this war Never getting bored, loves the blood and gore Always wanting more, feed him from the source They don't really understand until they feel the force apart And if you start shit, you'll be heartless in the darkness Torn apart quick, you left scars ripped You'll be chewed up and discarded and this world ain't right, won't accept it Negative energy, I expect it Once it's in your mind, it's infectious So fight for your life and reject it You better give me space, I'm protected My adrenaline spikes when I'm threatened And if you stay in my way, I'm aggressive Cause when there's no legs, it'll kill when I'm desperate This planet is not just comprised of land, sea, and sky. There is another habitat right beneath your very feet. The various cave systems give way to a hollow earth environment. 
This energy-rich ecosystem is not only where the first dragonoids evolved, but is where creatures of titanic proportions live, breed, fight, and die. Among these beasts is the titanic raptor Tetravern, a pack hooding shadow upon the land when it comes time to reproduce, a mated pair will make their way up to the surface where they can protect and feed their young more effectively. This breeding pattern doesn't occur often due to the creature's long lifespan, but when it does, Taranem's entire population of both citizen and creature takes a dramatic nosedive. Just one of these titanic creatures is enough to throw an entire ecosystem out of balance. But a mated pair, feeding god knows how many young, it is truly a catastrophe. If you ignite him, he's a road ahead of full prophecy To be the greatest beast the world has ever seen I feed him every day like the bones clean I feed him all the hate and he grows me And he gets caught through a big piss off quick And if you cross him, you might drop dead Metaphorically, of course, said to live this horror Never getting bored, loves the blood and gore Always wanting more freedom from the source They don't really understand until they feel the force apart And if you start shit, you'll be heartless in the darkness Torn apart quick, you left scars ripped You'll be chewed up and discarded And this world ain't right, won't accept it Negative energy, I expect it apex among apex predators surveying the grasslands of Taranem for prey the meteor lung lives up to its name with deadly accuracy when it spots prey in an open environment the meteor lung will dive towards its target its head smoldering with intense heat the prey isn't just killed it's pulverized when the meteor lung impacts after a deafening roar that can be heard from miles away the dragonoid's bone crushing jaws laps up the victim's remains over time the meteor lung's rock armor will chip and break away with impact after impact but will only totally be removed when the meteor lung needs to shed its skin and this is the only time an adult Dragonoid is truly vulnerable. But even so, the Meteor Lung is a creature none should dare trifle with lightly. If you ignite him, he's a road ahead of full prophecy To be the greatest beast the world has ever seen I feed him every day like the bones clean I feed him all the hate and he grows me And he gets caught through a big piss off quick And if you cross him, you might drop dead Metaphorically, of course, said to live this war Never getting bored, loves the blood and gore Always wanting more freedom from the source They don't really understand until they feel the force apart And if you start shit, you'll be heartless in the darkness Torn apart quick, you left scars ripped You'll be chewed up and discarded And this world ain't right, won't accept it Negative energy, I expect it once it's in your mind, it's infectious So fight for your life and reject it You better give me space, I'm protective My adrenaline spikes when I'm threatened And if you stay in my way, I'm aggressive Cause when there's no legs, it'll kill when I'm desperate Following a dragonoid that eats the biggest and toughest is a worm that eats the smallest and weakest. The flower pot worm is an insect larva specialist, melting through rock to access the nursery chambers of breeding insects and devouring the young. This worm is so small, so thin, its whole body can wrap around a human pinky finger several times. 
but upon touching the fur of the flower pot worm, the fibers will be embedded in your skin, causing irritation and swelling. If you ignite him, he's a rogue ahead of full prophecy To be the greatest beast the world has ever seen I feed him every day like the bones clean I feed him all the hate and he grows me And he gets caused real big pissed off quick And if you cross him, you might drop dead Metaphorically, of course, said to live this or Never getting bored, loves the blood and gore Always wanting more feeding from the source They don't really understand until they feel the force apart And if you start shit, you'll be heartless in the darkness Torn apart quick, you left scars ripped You'll be chewed up and discarded and this world ain't right, won't accept it Negative energy, I expect it Once it's in your mind, it's infectious So fight for your life and reject it You better give me space, I'm protected My adrenaline spikes when I'm threatened And if you stay in my way, I'm aggressive Cause when there's no legs, it'll kill when I'm desperate An aquatic bully that guards its territory ferociously, the coral crusher lindworm mostly subsides on mollusks and underwater invertebrates, cracking their shells either with jaw strength or masses of coral the creature can dislodge and weaponize. Naturally living in Tarinem's coral reef, the lindworm can wander upstream into freshwater habitats, where it's directly made up of fish and small animals, and its ability to pick up and weaponize coral is substituted with stone. If you ignite him, he's a rogue ahead of full prophecy To be the greatest beast the world has ever seen I feed him every day like the bones clean I feed him all the hate and he grows me And he gets caused real big pissed off quick And if you cross him, you might drop dead Metaphorically, of course, said to live this war Never getting bored, loves the blood and gore Always wanting more freedom from the source They don't really understand until they feel the force apart And if you start shit, you'll be heartless in the darkness Torn apart quick, you left scars ripped You'll be chewed up and discarded and this world ain't right, won't accept it Negative energy, I expect it Once it's in your mind, it's infectious So fight for your life and reject it You better give me space, I'm protective My adrenaline spikes when I'm threatened And if you stay in my way, I'm aggressive Cause when there's no legs, it'll kill when I'm desperate A species that migrated to Taranem from an entirely different planet by means that will be later discussed. The ancestors of this species glided through the air like a large predatory whale, but lost this ability once migrating to Taranem, but substituted their aerial affinity for one of water. And since its arrival, the Taranem Fey Lord Hexagon is now an apex predator on power and in direct competition with the Meteor Lung. Its supernatural ability to control and produce water comes in handy when making contact with the superheated rock of the Meteor Lung. Some well-honed blasts have even been known to alter the path of a descending Meteor Lung, after which the Fey Lord Hexagon will impale the Lung with their long, scythe-like appendages. I 
economy. You better watch out if your economy's a road ahead of full prop C to be the greatest beast the world has ever seen. I feed him every day like the bones clean. I feed him all the hate and he grows me. And he gets caught through a big piss off quick. And if you cross him, you might drop dead. Metaphorically, of course, said to live this or never getting bored. Loves the blood and gore. Always wanting more freedom from the source. They don't really understand until they feel the force apart. And if you start shit, you'll be heartless in the darkness. Torn apart quick, you left scars ripped. You'll be chewed up and discarded. And this world ain't right, won't accept it. Negative energy, I expect it. Once it's in your mind, it's infectious. So fight for your life and reject it. You better give me space, I'm protective. My adrenaline spikes when I'm threatened. And if you stay in my way, I'm aggressive. Cause when there's no legs, it'll kill when I'm desperate. I expect it Once it's in your mind It's infectious So fight for your life And reject it You better give me space I'm protective My adrenaline spikes When I'm threatened And if you stay in my way I'm aggressive Cause when there's no legs It'll kill when I'm desperate Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to be notified of future uploads. And join me on Twitch, where you can watch me draw live. Now, have a wonderful rest of your day, and happy Smogist.